Uh, okay, we will be talking about big nation. Okay, the next one. Okay, this is our go uh, back. This is our YouTube uh, handle. You can just when you check here, you're going to see big nation's activities. Uh, we have videos like I told you last week Wednesday. I had the first big nation meeting in Africa. It's already on YouTube, so you could check. Now, this guy, Cody Wilson, said increasingly all political questions that we could fight about have been relegated to an administrative sphere. So I could spend my entire career becoming one member, sorry, go back, go back. One member of some of some segment of the government yearly as hard as I could for many years making a career. Or I could write software that totally explored the paradigm shift. True or false? Now what this guy is just saying is very simple. I can decide to be a part of PDP, ABC, APGA, YMCA, I mean what's their name? And you know you could name them all the political parties. I could want I, I can desire to be a part of them. But I tell you the truth, how many people in those political parties will talk and people will hear? Say now, all of us now, we belong to ABC. Can we voice anything and ABC will hear us? Can we say, okay, now, we in Nigeria Sanders drop Lalo, uh, will they hear us? Nobody will hear you, okay? So, uh, now, this guy is saying that I want to do something for myself, I want to do it differently, I want to do it better. I want to have my own um, my own wall, okay? I want to do things the way I want them to. I want to see, I want to do the things I want to see. Cool? Okay, let's go. Now, would you like to choose government services just like you choose your cell phones? Like uh, you choose MTN, you choose Nokia, you choose Techno. Do you want to now say, this is the kind of service I want government to provide for me? Do you understand me? Yes, like saying, okay, uh, from now henceforth, the government services I want is, I want to have um, kunu every day in my house. Okay? Or my lunch should be supplied by the government. Or you say, uh, from today henceforth, I want the government to be giving me 50 bucks every day. Okay? I'm sure if we have the opportunity, we want to select the kind of services government provide. Have we? Let's go. Now, this Tetsu Oshi said, blockchain is, is not just for money. Uh, it's there for brand new governance structures, replacing the nation states. Thank you. Uh, replacing the nation states concept from the era of Napoleon. Digital nomads like me know that national borders are imaginary. Our activities are global, but most services are still for local. The government's marriage system is one of the most obsolete systems today. Marriage is a very personal matter, but it is being enforced by government and the laws are so different in each country. True or false? Now, how many of you can show me the border between Tudumoda and Locos? Or how many of you know where exactly the border between Jos and Bauchi is? Like this is the line. This is where this is the line. How many of you? All these borders are just on our head. Abi? They are just concepts that someone just decided to say, okay, let me draw up. These are the borders. And this every from today, everybody should abide, should apply to these rules and regulations. Let's go forward. Oh, eh? Okay, sorry. 
Okay, now, global geographical governance, oligo, oli, oligo, oli, that's the nation state. Okay, what we mean by nation state is like now we have Nigeria, we have Chad, we have Niger, and then different nations around the world. Okay, now, war, injustice, corruption, taxes are all what characterize the state. Is it true or false that we're having war in Nigeria? Is it true or false that we're having injustice in this country? Is it true or false that we have multiple taxation? Now, that's the problem with what we call a nation state. Cool? Current governance, uh, current governance providers don't need to compete in their territory. Now, what big nation wants to do? They want to give you, we want to give you a platform whereby people can say can compete for you to be a part of big nation say maybe there's a nation in the other big nation then people now compete for you to associate with them rather than the other party do you understand now big nation gives you an ability to also create your own world that people can be a part of you can say okay in my own world okay I want to have only ladies, all right? And then only those ladies, I don't want them to be wearing skirts. I want them to be wearing trousers. And the trousers, I want them to wear jeans. And the jean, I want them to wear crazy jean. Now you are going to make it juicy. You're going to make it advertising. You're going to make it uh, enticing, rather. You are going to make it inviting for me and, and any other person to want to belong to your own um, nation, okay? Current governance providers, okay, we'll, we'll skip that. Now, no competition equals no incentive for better services. Uh, because there is no competition in this nation state, you are forced to be in Nigeria. True or false? If you have an option, I know, we will choose. Me, if I have an option, tell me where I want to be. I want to be in Jamaica. Yeah. And I'm sure if you have an option, you want to be a Chadian. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you want to be not Chad. Okay. Now the next one. Uh, can you? Okay. Okay. Now. Sorry. Sorry. Go back. Go back. The next slide. Ah no. Four. 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 Okay. Now, uh, what is Pangea? Now, like I said, I just finished it. Now, Big Nation, it's a platform, okay, that allows you to create the kind of governance services you want for people to be a part of. Do we understand? Now, um, this is Rangana, okay? This is if you have an option of owning um, Rentia community. I'm sure there are things you want to see happening in Rentia, okay? And then there are things that everybody, you would give them, you would give as an option, so that it's going to invite other people to want to come and be part of Rentia. That's what Big Nation wants to do. Big Nation wants to give you an avenue to make what you have to be able to present it to, to the world, you are going to have an opportunity to create a platform where other people will compete to be a part of. Okay? Do you understand? Uh -huh. You're supposed to, you're going to create something that will show the world that it's worth having. Okay? If your problem is you don't like the way government do multiple taxation, maybe you don't like what kind of services government provide. You can have on big nation, you can have a an avenue for you to be able to have a community of your own. Okay? And then one important thing is that what big nation wants to do, it wants to take away the barrier of border. Someone in in England can be a part of the nation you create on big nation. 
Okay? Someone in India can be a part of it here. So you here in Nigeria, you are now giving someone an avenue to become to be a part of Nigeria, even though he's not physically around. But with time, who knows? With time, maybe we'll be able to have an avenue where all of us on a particular nation can be able to meet physically, okay, and do other things. All right. Now, but we want to start from somewhere. We want to give you an avenue whereby you can create something and sell to the world through Big Nation. That people can patronize services that you provide as well. Okay? Now, what Big Nation does, we have successfully come up with an, an application. It is called Pangea. Now, what is Pangea used for? It is used to create binding peer-to-peer -peer smart contracts via a decentralized mobile chat app. All of us, like we have WhatsApp, we have WeChat, and then you can name them. We used to have to go. We have Facebook Messenger. Now, what Big Nation has successfully done is to be able to create a chat, I'm um, sorry, an application that will allow you to chat, okay? So that you can keep in touch with people on the nation you created. Now, do you see the reality of Big Nation? You see, they are, they, they are not just saying create a world, okay? But they are now giving you an avenue, okay? Where you can now have a, a, a communication within the people in your own nation. Now, the second thing is that you'll be able to resolve disputes through the peer-to-peer -peer market for arbitration services. Now, this is when there is an issue in the nation. We all know that possibly maybe there will be, in the future, you might, maybe someone might provide a service to you that you don't like, okay? And uh, because the person is not with you, Big Nation will give you an avenue to be able to settle the issue. Do we get it? So it is not just an internet kind of thing. It is, it is something that we can catch. Okay, now the third one is to create and join virtual nations and communities. Like I earlier told you, Big Nation has created the app Pangea so that you will be able to join a nation. You can also create your own nation. You can create your own community on Big Nation through the Pangea Okay? Let's go forward. Now, we have, so far, okay, based on research, mobile usage, 3.6 billion cell phones users, 60% in developing world, 2.6 billion smartphones, now it means that you and I are part of these people that are using these cell phones, okay? We're part of these people in the developing world. And we are part of those ones that are also using smartphones. I'm sure right now, almost all of us here, we have one application, oh, sorry, we have a phone that can either connect us to WhatsApp, Facebook Messenger, or another um, form of chatting. Right? Uh -huh. So we, we are part of these people, 3.6 billion. Now, the second one is main mobile chat app application. Uh, about 2.3 billion monthly average usage of WeChat, Facebook Messenger, Snapchat, WhatsApp, Line, Kyoka, Talk, and so on and so forth. But example is one I used to go back. But I don't know. Maybe some people are still using to go. Perhaps maybe to go will come up some other day on this. Um, uh, but this is a huge number. This is a very huge number of people. You and I are contributing to this. So we want to also give you another venue whereby you will now have a Pangea app that you provide services. Most of this app. Tell you they have a lot of disadvantages. Okay? On all 
all these applications, when you enter somebody with your with your with your life or with your finances, I tell you the truth, the person can run away and then you don't have how to track him. But Pangea, we have created an avenue for you to settle disputes. So you do business with someone on the same platform, Big Nation. I tell you the truth, the person cannot scam you. That's the advantage of having the Pangea app and then running, being a part of Big Nation. Um, global legal services on the on global legal services market about six hundred billion dollars per annum. That's how much people pay for legal services. Let's go forward. Okay, now all contracts begin with a conversation, true or false. If I want to strike a contract with you, Nodia, I will have to start a conversation. Now, and smartphones chat is increasingly becoming the go-to tool for conducting business in emerging markets. For those, re for those reasons, we are convinced that our jurisdiction needs a chat interface. The reason why we came up with the Pangea app was because we, no we noticed hmm, this, that for us to be able to be very effective, okay, for big nation to be very effective, we need to have an application that can allow us to chat with one another. Okay. Now, the, the next thing is, Telesa allows you to operate without access to internet connection. Enabled, enabled by Marsh Network and, and SneakerNet, imagine the possibility for places without limited or, sorry, with limited or no access to a working internet connection. Um, we were supposed to be doing a live stream. Okay. My, my friends from Big Nation wanted to see what we're doing today, a live connection. But because the internet connection is very bad, I couldn't go live. I couldn't do a live streaming. Okay? So that's why we now de decided that, okay, in Lantan North, in Pajat, or somewhere where you cannot have a very stable internet connection, what will you do? Does that mean that if you have internet on your phone, you are going to cut off from the mission? Sorry, let me know this. Now, cut off from the mission, we, we came up with advanced technology and said okay how many of us know uh, free basics from what from uh, Etel? Etel. you know free basics Etel provides you free facebook services free opera mini services even when you don't have in data good now this this mesh network is what has enabled uh, Etel to be able to achieve this that is what Pangea app will do for you. So even if you are in your village, you don't need to worry. Say for instance, I have a contract with you, and then I went to a place where no uh, internet connection. I tell you the truth, the Pangea app will allow me to communicate with you, even when I don't have internet. Do you understand? Do you see how simple it has become? Now this Pangea app was developed with you and I on, um, on the equation. We were factored into the equation. What if we, because the, de the developed world, they have these facilities intact, they don't have anything to worry about internet. But till this very day, what we are using in this country is uh, the 3.5G internet connection. Meanwhile, in the developed world, they are using 5G. So do you see how we are left behind? Okay, so now Pangea app will enable you to be able to use, to be able to get in touch, to keep a connection, even when you don't have internet connection at all. Do we get it? Let's move forward. Now, 80% of, of, of the world's population live in the frontier emerging market. You and I were part of this 80%. That's why anything you bring to this country goes. Okay? 
because we are still an emerging world. Two billion unbanked adults, this is very true, but a 10 trillion dollar system key economy. Now, this is what comprises of what we have right now that is obtainable in this world. Next. Now, because bad passport makes it difficult to, uh, or impossible to migrate. Two, yeah, sorry, the second, the second bullet is two billion adults in the world are currently from bank. If the great area, sorry, if the great economy was a nation, it would be the second largest economy in the whole world. Bad passport. You and I, ma'am. Hmm? Because Nigeria has, a, has the thing. You and I now, if you come on this common chart, if you want to go to chart, eh? and you are holding Nigeria's, pass, Nigeria's passport, if you are not going to cut corner, I tell you, you will be looked with one kind of eye. Hmm? Me, I've had experiences outside this country with my green passport. Do you understand? Eh -eh. Because I'm holding a passport. For big nation, guess what big nation wants to do? Big nation wants us to have access to a community. That's why they want us to now create our own world for ourselves. Where if I want to, if I need any services from Nancy, eh, I should be able to get it without stress. You now, if someone from maybe a friend of yours who is staying in Greece needs some kind of services from you, you should get it without stress. Come see Big Nation. Do you understand? That's what Big Nation wants to do. Big Nation wants to make the world very small for you. So that you and I will not stress to get anything. Do you understand? They want you to create what you want to see. Me, like I told you, I'm already a part of it. Let's move forward. Passports are bad. Sorry, passports are by no means necessary. Unfortunately, the global appetite condemns, condemns millions of people to stay in their improvised, impro impoverished home countries. My hope rests in the big nation platform, which possibly provides everyone in the world with a unique ID, with a unique ID on the blockchain, which could be recognized as official travel documents by governments. Okay. Now I see this guy is nodding. Um, the blockchain, let me talk about the ID on the blockchain. Now the blockchain is the system, okay, that collects information, okay? You put it, the information you put in, if you put the information here, and then you want it here, you get the information, without anybody or anything interfering with it. So, uh, imagine you and I now, we hold Big Nation passport, okay? And then you want to visit me. You don't have stress. Even if I stay in, in Antarctica, hmm? yes, if I stay in Antarctica, you have no stress because you are now holding a big nation passport that will possibly be recognized by any government in this world. So it now makes us, it now makes it very easy for us to be able to, uh, to be able to communicate with anybody in this world without stress. Do you understand? But well, first of all, we want to start with the Pangea app. That's why it has now been it, it is now being developed. And possibly before the end of this year, it's going to fully be functional. I have it on my phone. It's actually running right now. The Pangea app. I, I have it on my phone. I will show you. I will give it to some of you who want to see what it looks like, and then possibly begin to practice how to create your own nation and then whatever kind of services you want to provide. So the assignment now is for you to begin to think, what can I provide for someone? What do, you, what do I think someone is in need of? Or what kind of services is the government
government not provide that it can actually provide for someone to access using Bit Nation. Using Bit Nation. Okay, so the next one is this is just a very simple blockchain identification chart. Okay, it's going to look like if you can see blockchain identification proof of existence, Bit Nation governance, 2.0, smart, sound. Da, 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 da. So this is just how it's going to look like. This is how sorry it looks like. Okay, the uh, the blockchain application, okay. titles and business deals. Do you know? I heard of a story just last week. Okay, that someone um, sorry that someone borrowed. Did he borrow? Someone bought a land, okay, and then he went there. After a while, he went there. Then he now discovered that some people had already raised a structure. Mm -hmm. eh? Do you understand? Mm -hmm. That some people had already raised a structure. And so he started, when he started asking, who is the owner of this? Then someone now advised him, Garamaka Garona system. Because if you continue, I tell you the truth, you might end up losing your life. Okay? So that's how bad it is. That's how bad it can be. That all these things, but the blockchain now is now an advanced kind of technology to help us have these things intact. So that when we need them, okay, you don't need to go and you need to ask anybody. The blockchain will tell you, no, you have record, you have registered this thing under this name, and um, this is the information. This was the date. So you are going to have what you imputed out. Do we get it? Then. Okay. So the next one is documents are permanent, are permanently secured with easy access. Blockchain will provide documents, authenticity, and your crew and your ownership at all times. So the blockchain is like, it's going to give you a proof of ownership. Okay? Uh, anybody, nobody can mess up with the documents that you put in the blockchain. So don't be scared. If now you are a part of Big Nation, and then you want to go on, and then you, your, 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 uh, your details are stored on the blockchain, nobody can steal it. This Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies, they use this for what they do, okay? The blockchain, okay? It's a way of just showing the way the transaction is moving. Do you understand? So, next one. Now, this is our brother. This is our brother is a Ghanaian, okay? He said, most of the properties in my country have no title because of cumbersome process and corruption. A decentralized land administration access, accessible to everyone is what is needed. And the blockchain offers that very cheap. Sooner than later, the state is going to become obsolete. Now, this guy is saying that the way things are going, right? The blockchain is just the most effective way to curb organization. Do you understand? He's, he is now saying that very soon, Nigeria will become very obsolete. It means that having to become a, having to be a Nigerian will be a thing of the past. Okay? Or to be a, to be a, the state, the nation, everything about because everything now, if you look at it, everything is becoming very digitalized. Almost everything. We used to we used to have we used to have textbooks when we go to schools, but now we have e-books that you just have on your phone or on your tab, and then you are you are good for the semester, or good for the for the whole school session. Okay, so things are getting um, digitalized. But I think we in the developing world we are a bit underprivileged because we are still following like 30 years behind. Mm. But this is an avenue for us to speed up. 
Do you understand? Uh, this is another venue for us to actually move very fast. The reason why we don't, why I didn't invite old people here is because we are the ones to move things. Do we understand? Uh -huh. We are the ones to, we are more hopeful, we have dreams that we want to see coming to be a reality. We want to achieve a lot of things for ourselves. Mungani, okay. Now, Big Nation so far has about 10,000 citizens, uh, 2,000 open source contributors, uh, that means people that are contributing to Big Nation, uh, that are adding up to the resources of Big Nation, about 2,000. Then we have 100,000 lines of codes. Okay, that's this uh, programming terms. Then we have 200 embassies and consulates. Very soon we hope to have an embassy in Nigeria or possibly even in Jos, where all of you can come in and go out at, at when you want. That's if you decide to be a part of the nation. Okay, you can now come in and go out. You can have the services the nation provides at any time, at any point. Uh, then we have 5,000 contracts neutralized. Next. Now, our technology state, Big Nation works with Ethereum net, uh, network, and then Golem, IPFS, we have RSK, and then what's the next one? SSP. B, SSB. Okay, these are the technologies whereby Big Nation is built on. Uh, the next one. Yeah, now today, Tolerant Match Protocol. Match Protocol. For the Lesser Match Network building on SSB code plus IPS. IPFS. No? No? Now, ID representation contract. Yeah, sorry, ID representation is based on the Big Nation slash Lucy. Uh, now, this ID representation, like I told you, is going to be based on uh, if you become a member, okay, then like we all know, we all have national ID cards, okay, that's because we belong to a country called Nigeria, do you understand? So big nation, like I told you, wants now to be creating nations, so it means that uh, like we all have our unique cell phone numbers, nobody has to, you don't have my own power, okay, on MTN network, you cannot have my number. Is it that one line will be blocked and then the other activated? Or when they deactivate me, then they assign it to you. So that's what we need. We need to have identification as well. Now, smart contracts is based on the Ethereum network. Then wallet and escrows is also based on the Ethereum network. Now, this wallet is like a strong house for you, okay? Uh, whereby you put all the e currencies, the, sorry, the cryptocurrencies, you put them inside. The, you have to have a wallet if you are going to now begin to trade Bitcoin, Ethereum, and other cryptocurrencies. You will need a wallet. Now, the escrows is where it's like a storehouse. Okay, sorry, it's like a, an intermediary whereby when I have a contract with Bernard's, what I do is I keep whatever, um, if I'm going to pay him, I'll now keep the money in the escrows, I mean whatever contract terms there. When he's done, okay, so that me, I, like I told you, that's why I, I said there is nothing like scam. When he is done, okay, he will now access whatever funds he has through the ex escrows. Okay, he's going to, now his funds will be released to him because he has provided the service to me. So there is nothing like scam. Then the to to tokenized assets, Ethereum, neutralization uh, time down Ethereum, uh, storage and search, Lucifer, like IP address. Oh, now, okay. Big Nation Pangea is here, decentralized 
encrypted open source dispute resolution chart mesh, decentralized borderless visual, virtual mission DVN, DVN, a blockchain jurisdiction. Now, when you talk about this decentralized borderless virtual mission, what this mission can do is here decentralized encrypted open source dispute resolution chart mesh. Decentralized borderless visual virtual mission DVN DVN a blockchain jurisdiction. Now let me talk about this decentralized borderless virtual mission. What this means, ma? It is when you become a part of Big Nation, or what Big Nation is offering you. It is offering you a decentralized system. A system whereby it is not based on what Lalong has to approve for Plateau State or what Buhari has to say in regards to headsmen. Okay? Or it doesn't have to, it, does, it is not based on anybody's idea of, govern, of governance. You choose what you want. If, for instance, now I belong to a nation that you created, okay? I will now choose what I want. Okay? If what you are giving me in your nation is not what I want, I will now go out and then become a part of this nation. That is why it's going to be competitive. Okay? It is going to be very competitive. So like I said, you should begin to think about what you want to see. Do you understand? It's going to be one, it's going to be very competitive. Two, it is going, it should be very inviting. If you provide services that I don't want, why should I continue to remain there? I'll go to another place where I feel it is more of interest to me rather than what you're giving me. So it is going to be, so that's why it is borderless and then it is decentralized. There is no border in Big Nation. There is no, this is just my work. No, no. It is, it is a free world for everybody. Then it is virtual and then it is based on the blockchain jurisdiction. Like I told you, it is based on the blockchain will now give it will now make it very transparent and very effective. Choices, sorry, choice of code of law. Now you can decide whether in your own nation, now if you decide to create a nation for, for us all here, you can choose whether you want a common law, a civic law, a civil code of law, or a Sharia law, or maybe you want to say this should be a nation for only Christians, or Muslims, or Buddhists, okay? Or you can choose anything you want, okay? Then smart contracts build a belt automatically through chat using emoticons. Now, just like we use WhatsApp, okay, you can now initiate a contract with someone using the Pajia chat app. You can say, okay, this is what I want you to do for me. And then you can now initiate, like we all agree, that before a contract will start, uh, it has to be through a conversation. So this is what Big Nation is offering you. Then choice of attributors, so arbitrate arbitrators and witnesses. You can decide to choose who is going to stand as a witness for you when you are in, when you are engaging someone in a contract on Belgium. All these things are actually very obtainable on the Belgia app. Then you decide, decided by ID or reputation or crowd juries. Now, like I said, that this is where the ID will now come in. If you say I'm going to be your witness on this particular contract, then you can now decide to either use your identification for the to be a witness, or you can decide to say, okay, maybe by reputation. Or maybe a crowd will decide to say, okay, this person should do this or that. Now, the next one is, this is an example, example of third party applications slash contracts that can be built on top of the big nation 
by GR protocol. Now, this is just an example, okay? This one here, it is called Smart Love, which is contract of the marriage, and then all land titles, or dispute with a resolution, or birth certificates, then we have wheels, and then get to get security. Now, business incorporation, uh, residents, basic income, get to get insurance, trade agreements, resource allocation, what's the last one? Healthcare. Uh, Punjab API contracts execute on the Ethereum block network. Now, these are, like I said, these are just examples of what you, they are obtainable on the Punjab uh, app application. In July 20, sorry, in July 2014, Big Nation was given birth to. Do you understand? So, Big Nation is barely four years. By July 14, Big Nation is going to be four years. And then, uh, first blockchain marriage, friendship, ID, is that friendship? What? First blockchain marriage, world citizenship ID, and other pilots. Uh, yeah, there was a blockchain marriage, uh, world citizenship ID, like we saw that other one. And then, so, now, um, uh, what do you, uh, Big Nation also did an emergency uh, refugee response service in 2015. Blockchain ID citizenship, embassy functionalities, possibly did those um, uh, services. And then uh, in 2016, decentralized borderless visual nation and Pangea 0.2 was launched. And then in 2016 again, at least I have been Okay. Now in, in 2015, first uh, iteration of Pangea using the horizontal chain, blockchain land, titles, bird certificate, pilots conducted, public uh, not only really. created in cooperation with Estonia <laughs> e-residency program. Now let me tell you what Estonia does. Uh, Estonia is a nation like Nigeria. But do you know what they trade with? They trade with uh, cryptocurrency. It is legal for you to, to do business with cryptocurrency in uh, Estonia. And then they are east. We, have, we also have provision for electronic citizenship, a residency. Okay? So you here in Nigeria, you can be a part of Estonia. Like, when you want to do election, you too, you will, you will vote. Okay? While you are here, you can vote. Do you understand? This is what Big Nation wants to achieve in the long run. That your location in the world truly matters. Uh, IPFS, Path and Nesco Flow, IPFS, Centric Pergia, Path End, Path End, Path OK Design and Nesco, Nesco Flow Award. Okay, so let's go Yes, now this is where it, this is where it will interest me to tell you that these guys here, I bet you, they cannot have internet connection. True or false? They don't look like people who have internet connection, do they? No, he is. But see something, my aim is to help spread the overall peer-to-peer -peer movement and its what? Reflection. Reflection, Reflection through Bitcoin and similar technologies. Big Nation represents that very idea in a diverse and versatile manner. That not, that, that not only empowers individuals but also entire nations who have been left without a voice. See what Big Nation wants to do. 
Big Nation wants to give us a voice to speak for ourselves. Do you understand? Big Nation wants you to advertise yourself to the world. I'll tell you something about this. Uh, make a proposal to Big Nation to decentralize borderless visual nation to fund your own governance project. Isn't this interesting? Mm -hmm. huh? Let me talk about so Okay, now Big Nation is a decentralized borderless million nation, DBBN, powered by Billion Blockchain. Our democratic governance structure allows you to create your own columns and invest or donate into Bologna's project and different parts of Big Nation's own infrastructure depending on what matters to you. Uh, we have a, we have a, sorry, go back. There is a constitution, there is a slack discussion, intro video, follow DBN points on Ethereum, then there is a code for each. Go on. Now, those are just uh, examples. Okay, and move forward. These are our progress report. Uh, this is in that was in Cuba. This is in uh, Barcelona. Uh, you can move forward. And this is uh, another one in Bratislava. This is in Istanbul. All these are part of Big Nation. Uh, now, this is uh, Sudan. Who came up with this very brilliant idea of Big Nation? She sat down in 2014, of course. Before 2014, she had actually been involved in a lot of things around the world, a lot of things. And she sat down and thought about this. Now, what if everybody decides to do what he wants to do? Not somebody controlling it. And she said, okay, what if you decide to now create a solution for other people? And she said, okay, how can I achieve it? Then she now came up with the concept of Big Nation. And finally, Big Nation was launched in July 14, 2014. Uh, she said, what we're doing in making nations, sorry, what we're doing what Big Nation is doing is making nation state gov governments entirely irrelevant. No government, whether democratic or autocratic, can survive without the consent of its subjects. We all here huh? hmm? wouldn't have come here without agreeing to come. Do you understand? I can't come here and talk to to these chairs. It's not going to make sense. Do we get it? Now, she said, the con okay, without the concept of the subject. In the same way, Bitcoin, I, I, I told you how powerful Bitcoin is, right? In the same way Bitcoin has transformed the financial systems, Big Nation will irreversibly change the political system and the course of history. Now, I heard recently, right, that in Nigeria, people are now beginning to take off their money and buy Bitcoin. Hmm? Leaving the banks without hope. And that's why the government wants to stop cryptocurrency activities in Nigeria. But I'm not sure if that's possible. Do you do you agree that it's going to be possible? Mm -hmm. That they will stop cryptocurrency activities in Nigeria? Can they do it? It has become a decentralized system already. A lot of people do it even without government knowing it. Okay? So this is what big nation big nations want big nation wants to do. In the future make nation states very irrelevant. So how would you feel if someone somewhere seated somewhere said that because of you 
I can now live the life I wanted to live. Because you started this project, I mean, because you started this nation on this nation, I can now have the life I want to have, I want to live. How do you feel? Becoming a solution to someone somewhere elsewhere. How would you feel if you are, if you give someone the opportunity to live the life that he has been dreaming right from childhood to the stage in age? So Big Nation wants us to have a borderless nation, a borderless community where it is not controlled by anybody. Do we get it? Okay, now this Big uh, Nation is saying in BBC, CNN, and then other channels. You Okay, thank you very much. The uh, sorry, the last, the last one. No, 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 no. The last one. Thank you for the last one. 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 You can check this nation on Facebook or Twitter or Big Nation's, um, uh, Big Nation's website or on the blogs. So right now I would want to entertain any kind of questions you have. Maybe you would want to ask me now, like I said, ask the toughest questions you can ask. And then I will glad to answer you. And anyone that I cannot answer, I promise you I will come back to give you an answer. So let me have the questions please. Yes, your best question. Okay, can we have this mic for Let me see if One, two. Yes. Um, Good evening, though. Good evening. Uh, my name is Barry okay. you, know, you talk about the Bitcoin uh, borderless border and uh, you talk about you talk about the uh, you can you know the uh, secret passport. Uh, okay, no, 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 big nation. Big nation. Yeah. 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 Can you elaborate more on that way? Okay, okay. Like I said about the uh, big nation and the passport. In the long run, okay, big nation wants you to have access to anywhere you want to go to. Okay? Through uh, possibly. Maybe the nation that you're going to create on the Tunjiaha is now going to now give you an access to move out. But subsequently, other people have asked if there is a way we can have big nation passport, okay, like travel documents that you can go to anywhere and then any government in the world will accept. But you know that's a very cumbersome process. It has to go through a lot of process and all that. And uh, so far, Big Nation has some lawyers who are working currently on this issue, and they hope to be able to find a solution to it. Okay? Yeah. So, um, any question? <coughs> sorry. Yeah. Sorry. You can. Before, sorry. Sorry. Yes. So maybe when there is an update, okay, about any progress concerning Big Nation. I will let you know. Yes. First of all, I want to say thank you for the call. Although it's very comprehensive and but what I actually expected well from me was uh, about Bitcoin investment, cryptocurrency and so but I I understand that Big Nation is is a uh, is a platform that provides you the opportunity to do all of those yeah. things. Yeah. So it's actually a good one. But I would love if you go into Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies specifically, okay. how to invest on those, maybe on Bitcoin. Okay. Yes. Oh, okay. Okay. Because I understand that uh, Bitcoin is just one of the things yeah, yeah. that you can do on Bitcoin. Okay. 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 Uh, okay, cool. In fact, this is one of the best questions I've had so far. Uh, thank you very much for asking this question. Now, Big Nation, okay? Uh, we, what we do, like I said, we, we are the network.
network is based on the Ethereum network, okay? And uh, you ask if you could invest on BitNation. Yes, you can. By next, next month, mm -hmm. I will check the date. I will confirm that. We are supposed to. Sorry, it's gone. Okay, we're supposed to have. We're going to have a particular attribution, arbitration token sale. Okay, it's like uh, it's like you buy shares. Okay, Big Nation would want you to invest. They want you to buy the token from them. Okay, so once the the sales date is announced, I'll let you know. Once it is, I will let you know so that um, we could. We, we, I will tell you how you can pay part of the token sales and then how much you can invest in Big Nation. This is a very brilliant idea. You are looking, you are thinking very far, you know, and I, and I love it. Thank you very much. Yes, no question. Okay, okay, yes. Okay, oh, oh you, okay, so you want to also. Invest. Thank you very much. I will tell you when the sales is going to start, then we can see how we will, how you can be a part of it. Okay? Yes. Any question again? Okay, so many questions. I'm sorry, the mic is Every day I will be giving you 100 bucks. 
all the people that want to get 100 naira every day will join. Okay? And then together you can see how, and don't forget, these nations will have rules and regulations. It can be bad, it can be good, depending on you. Okay? I was listening to uh, Suzanne on one of the YouTube uh, one of the YouTube videos, and someone was asking if if they could have a nation that just belongs to strippers. You know strippers now. <laughs> so she now said, "Yes. What's wrong with that? I don't have a problem with them. You know." And so I I think the guy was not very comfortable. But the truth about it is, that is what some people want to have, okay? That is what some people would love to see happening in their own nation. So you and I, we can decide to create our own nation, decide to do what we want, what we want to see happening, then we, we, we decide to see, we decide to, to create that, okay? So that's what Pangea and Big Nation is trying to Big Nation is trying to give you that access to Nigeria. Do you understand? Okay, any question? Okay, more questions. Okay, go ahead. I have to Yes. Um, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, like, we talk about the the last time, in the last time about uh, about nineteen thousand. Yeah, of course. So, uh, it was just an uh, just an illustration of what Bitcoin, how Bitcoin has been very successful. But uh, let me let me say something. Big Nation basically, okay, is working with the Ethereum network. So basically, Big Nation is working with Ethereum. Okay, I will tell you more about that if you maybe next time when we meet. When we meet next time, I will tell you about the Ethereum network. Uh, I'm sorry about the, the how you can get Ethereum and then how you can invest into it and then how you can buy your, your token on the Big Nation. Um, Big Nation token sales, the Pangea arbitration token sales. I will tell you how you can do that when next we meet. And I tell the sales should be very soon, very, very soon. So, uh, yes, I will tell you. Maybe by tomorrow I should be able to get the deals and pass across to you. Yes. Like the price of the token. Yes. I will tell you all that. Yes, yes. Thank you very much. Any question? Yes. Okay. If if I understand this uh, lecture very well, yes. Let's say junior, for example. Yes. On junior, we have different shops. Yes, yes. There are some that specialize on Ankara and so on. Mm. So I think this is what Big Nation is offering us: to create your own brand. Perfect. So perfect. The question here is: How do you benefit, or how do you benefit from you? Being like the owner of a nation, okay, in big nation, okay. Now, now, if you, if you are, if you are, if you are a, a, if you provide, hello, are we together? Yes. Yes. If you create a a nation, okay, and then you provide services, people can pay or not, okay. You making your own nation very competitive makes it very. If you make it very inviting, very juicy, you have very you have things that will invite people to come. I think it's going to go a long way in giving in, uh, in giving you other benefits. I don't know what you are thinking. I don't know what kind of nation you want to create, but the benefits are based on what you want to see happen. Okay. If you want to provide them based on sales or for free, then that's fine. Okay. Do you are you okay? Are you satisfied? Okay. Yeah, but Big Nation is trying to create a platform whereby you sell services to people. 
Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, you spoke about uh, having a nation of your own. Yes. As for now, wanting to be a boss of my own self in big nation. Yes. Won't having nations be so much that everyone wants to be a boss of himself to open his own nation as, as an individual? Then, if you do so, who is going to be the participants of your own nation? Then, or is it that there is a restriction to the nation you tend to start? Okay. Uh, thank you very much. We have how many people do we have in this world? We have about sorry. We have about we have about seven billion people. Have you got about seven billion people? Nine. Nine billion. Okay, no, I'm not sure of that. But I think over seven billion is this uh, about seven point five billion people. Tell me the truth. Are we going to have seven point five billion nation? Aha. Uh -huh. So we will have yes, we will have a lot of people providing uh, a lot of services, and that's. That's to tell me that it's going to be very cumbersome. It's going to be very taxing. Someone might not want to be attending to everybody's uh, trouble. Okay? He would just want to be a part of a nation. And if you haven't done that, then I'll go out and become another one. I'll go out and join another one. One very good, one very good advantage of being a member of Big Nation is you have the opportunity to join or go out. Do we understand? So it's as simple as that. You can join or you can go out. Do we get it? Yes. So that is just that about it. Any question again? Okay, thank you very much. Uh, I am happy to be here. And uh, thank you for your time and your effort. Bye-bye.